Hey guys, it's NV2095, and today I am bringing you a Moab gameplay. I know you guys are you guys are so excited right now, but I got some bad news for you guys. This isn't me playing right now. I'm actually in the match though. I get the Moab, but my theater mode wasn't working, so I had to get my friend's gameplay and use it just to show my Moab. So I was pretty upset about that. But I still got his, I still got the Moab, and you'll see later. But I at least the gameplay that I'm using is very like is interesting because he quick scopes, snipes all that junk, and he hits a collateral in like the first 50 seconds as I just watched there. I'm pretty sure that's what he hit, or maybe it was that. That was it. So I got a Moab. Pretty excited about that. But that's not something I really want to talk about. I did it in the 2v2 playlist though. And that's what I wanted to talk about. The 2v2 playlist. And I'm playing on a ground. A ground. Because me, me and For Days, whose gameplay I'm using, he was he was all excited when I told him that I was going to still use his gameplay anyways. Because I wanted to put the Moab up on my channel. And he, I mean not he, me and him keep playing this game type. Every time we get on number 3 only thing we play, just because we're so dominant at it. I'm pretty sure since we actually had a 35 games, uh, 35 winning streak, and since that winning streak, we've gone like 75 and like four, and our four losses, one included the end of the 36 game. It was 36 game. Why did I say 30? I think I said 39, but one of that ended was that was one of the four losses ended that streak, and then we've just lost to like two little kids, not two little kids, but like annoying little kids that would use the stupidest stuff and campers says the people that sit in a corner and don't move the whole game so it's impossible to get them because they only sit there and use a shotgun or something but that's we haven't we don't really care that much because we dominate we uh, put our clan tag as what we go for the day so I don't know if it is in this gameplay yeah it is we're seven now at this point in the gameplay just because we want to keep track of what we're doing see how we're doing and uh, it's not it's not for any reason like we do it legitly so if we lose we put it in there and I mean we've we've had some really successful days especially at the 36 win streak but I actually wanted to tell you guys I mean talk to you guys about how this this brought back like a competitive feeling to this game and just kinda just kinda let me have more fun on this game because I really want to play like something competitive just because that's what I like to do now, especially since I'm going to be getting Astro soon. And it's it's really smart of them to give away these free maps like this. Because these free maps, I mean, they're actually pretty fun. I I don't hate these maps. I actually pretty like them, especially ground, because we just destroy on the ground. And we have we have a strategy for this map, especially kill confirmed, which we're playing right now. We have a great strategy for that, and I can't tell you guys because that would just that would ruin the whole that would ruin the whole thing, and we would probably lose all the time then. So. What else is there? Oh, them Infinity War giving the maps. One of the smartest things I've ever seen them do. Like I, I didn't think they could give away free maps like this. I know there's, there's another map I think out there for the two v two playlist. I'm probably not gonna get it unless I really, really feel like in it. Or I just, just magically get sixteen hundred Microsoft points for summer or whatever it costs. And I mean, it'll be, it'll be pretty cool. But the two v two playlist is one of the better things I've done. I haven't played any one v one. I played a match of three v three. We won that. And that's that's all I played. I like the TVT though, because me and my friend have a lot of callouts. He actually hates Modern Warfare 3 except this. He actually said that this actually allows him to play the game again, because it was it was just that bad. And I don't I don't enjoy the game as much as I did in like MW2 and and Black Ops. I, I enjoy Black Ops playing competitive. That's actually what that made that game good for me was the competitive playing, and this made this game good for me because. I can get a bunch of wins and play competitively, which never thought I would really do on this game. I started, when it first came out, I started playing a little bit of GBs, but after that, I really never went to play any GBs, just because, I mean, we weren't we weren't very good, we didn't really practice, we didn't really care that much, but we played Kill Confirmed and got wrecked. Like, if I knew what i do now about Kill Confirmed, I probably would have, I mean, we probably would have done better. Um, but we got destroyed that match. It was it was just embarrassing. I I don't think I've ever lost that bad or felt. I mean, it felt really bad. Like every time I was just dying, and 
No one, I mean, we just couldn't get killed. These guys were walking around together, and you would kill one and die. That actually killed us one of the games we played. We were destroying these kids the past two matches. They decided they would run together on this map, but they were, like, camping right around, so they weren't just, like, running around like the rest of us. So it was it was kind of annoying, but I, I didn't mind it. Just, I mean, we lost. It's one of our four losses, and then they left because they thought they were cool, even though we beat them twice in a row before that. So doesn't really matter I think do I drop the mob soon oh I do it's like 30 seconds I think I don't know but I was I was really freaking out at this point when I had the Moab because it was just it was a stressful moment for me I had to pick up a 50 cal up oh, there I just dropped the mob I was really proud we actually freaked out probably like a good like five minutes well my friend did I kind of stopped freaking out after like two minutes but we were getting really excited when the screen just drops, you know, pretty awesome. I like the Moab more than I like the nuke, just because you don't have to put the nuke on, I mean, you don't have to put the Moab on, and it doesn't end the game for your team. So, once I got the Moab, we decided the game would be over in like 10 seconds, because I just was like, okay, let's just go collect, tag, collect tags and make the gameplay end in like 2 seconds. So, that's basically the end of the video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you like this Moab, and I hope, I'm sorry that I couldn't bring you guys my gameplay of it. But I still I still got it, as you can see from the gameplay. So thanks, guys, for watching. Don't forget to check out my commentary showdown that I still have up on my channel. You could still join, and you have like a week more to join. And thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, do all that stuff. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching.